Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in ScreenFlow 9. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to take your webcam footage or your camera footage, just like you're seeing right now, and create this circular picture in picture that you can drag around and place anywhere on your ScreenFlow videos. Let me show you how to do it in ScreenFlow 9. Okay, pretend that you're watching a webinar or a live stream. I'm setting up this amazing presentation I'm about to share with you. So I'm in full screen video right now. But now I say, so let's jump into Adobe After Effects so I can share this cool technique. So I take the full screen video and I shrink it down into this small little circle that I can place anywhere on the screen. I can go through the presentation or tutorial so it's not distracting and when I'm done I can go right back into the full screen mode and finish up the video. I'm going to select the video layer. I'm going to come up here to the inspector panel and click on this first property, the video properties. I'm going to twirl down cropping. I'll drag the left slider all the way to the right. I'm going to do the same for the right. We're not going to do anything for the top and the bottom. Now even though he's maxed out at 400, you can type in larger numbers. So for this example, I found that 584 worked. I'm going to go to the next one here to the right, and I'm going to type in 592. We're going to come down here to the corner round. I'm going to drag that all the way to the right. I'm going to type in 700. I'll hit enter or return, and now you see we have a circle. Pretty cool. But please note that these exact values that I use may produce different results for you depending on the resolution of your camera, the size of your ScreenFlow project, etc. But the concept will be the same. When you get a circle, you can save it as a style preset by clicking on this little cube, click on the plus, click on the plus again, you can give it a name, Now that we've created a style preset, when we go to the next clip that's in full screen mode, all we have to do is go up to the presets, locate that circle, click on it, and boom, we've got ourselves a circle. You can select the video layer, you can manually scale it in or move it around, or you can use all the properties over here in the inspector panel, change the scale, Maybe you want to add a little reflection or a drop shadow. If you need to make fine tune adjustments, maybe your video is a little off center in the circle. If you hold the control key, you'll see here that the little circle turns into a square with the control key. And I might nudge in the left side here and maybe make the right side a little bit bigger so I can get the video a little bit more centered. And now I'm just going to resize it, get it exactly where I want. I'm going to move this over here. I'll add a drop shadow. And now I'll create a style preset for that. So I'll create a new style preset. Click plus. I'm going to call that one small circle. So I've recorded my live stream. I'm in ScreenFlow editing. I'm setting up this amazing presentation. And now I'm ready to take this large video and move it into a circle. So I'm going to select the video layer. I'm going to add an action. And then I'm going to click on the style presets. And I created this second one here called small circle left. So I click on that. And now I've got myself a circle. So I go from full screen, there's the action, boom, goes into a circle. Perfect. Maybe I want to go back into full screen mode right here. So with the video layer selected, I can come up here to actions, add snapback, video, I'm back in full mode. So we're big, down to a circle, full screen mode. And now I want to go back one more time. So I'm going to click on the action again. I'll click on the style presets. Now I'm going to go to small circle right. And just like that, circle, big, circle. That is how you create a circle picture in picture in ScreenFlow 9. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.